her savings for them to have gone with the African American firm at five, at eleven dollars per household versus waste management at six. But all African American board consisting of five African American men decided that they wanted to stay with waste management. Now, according to the host of this show, I just learned that they wanted to stay with waste management because it's an election cycle. They did not want to rock the boat. They didn't want to go through the trouble and the issues that the city of Jackson recently went through. Well, I mean, and also because they were satisfied, and they told me their constituency was satisfied with what the service waste management was provided. Last time, I, last time I checked, their constituency consist of a county that's 80% African American. Would you think that an African American firm in a majority African American county with a million dollar savings could receive the award? And if they cannot, where the hell should an African American owned business go? Where, where do they have a chance to grow? Where do they have an opportunity? Should they go then to their master? Go crawling back to the plantation and says, well, you know, there are no opportunities out here for me. Please take me back, sir. Let me ask you this.